Thompson, DC Vigilante here. We aren't going away whatsoever. There is no silencing uh, people wanting the Snyder Cut, and I tell you why. Right, as you seen that picture about John Campier still going on about there's no cut, right? I wouldn't care less if there's only fragments of what Zack Snyder wanted. Right? For me, this cause is the same as Games of Thrones. Okay, we're sending out a message that we do not want Warner Bros. to harm any other director's influ uh, director's vision. We don't want that. We are sickened of what the DCU is slowly becoming. Uh, we were promised all these great films that that came to nothing. The actors that were promised. Uh, a uh, solo movie uh, have been cleared out and they are bringing in these other actors uh, depriving us of a universe that was once promised. We are sick of the way that Warner Brothers has treated most of the DC Universe. How it's treated even the Streamline Universe like Swamp Thing. Talk about cancellation and the uh, and they're constantly saying it's, you know, given us series like Batwoman that no other person has ever wanted and the reaction to that trailer says it all. We're also sickened of, um, of, you t of giving us films that nobody's asked for. We've never asked for The Trench, we've never asked for Supergirl. What we want and, and so for me, release the Snyder Cut is a lot more than just getting the, the Justice League movie that we deserve. But it's a, it's a standoff against fans and against this corporation that seems to believe that they know better. They don't. We are standing up uh, for Zack Snyder's uh, vision. We're standing up against the corruption that Warner Brothers has done to our beloved uh, DCEU and we demand that they listen to us. We are the people that want to buy the stuff. We are the customer. You should put our needs and our wants first. So John Campier or, or the rest, uh, anybody that sees it doesn't exist, we will never be silenced. We will keep on going on and on about it until we put it into existence. We, we will make this a reality by not forgiving uh, Warner Brothers until they treat us fairly and just. And by releasing the Snyder Cut means that Warner Brothers finally has put their hands up and saying what we did to Zach was wrong, how we've treated the fans was wrong. Instead of calling us trolls, call us, uh, you can just call us critics, or you can call us consumers, and consumers have the right to complain when we feel like we're buying shit stuff. So no, release the Snyder Cut campaign will never be silenced. We will bring it into existence, or we will go out fighting. We will constantly demand the release of this movie, and at least that is a product that the DC fans richly deserves.